1973 Oldsmobile Toronado. Beautiful car. I've owned this for about five years. I think I bought this in 2014. And I was at a car auction with a friend of mine. And it was one of those days where I was just going for entertainment purposes. And I uh, just fell in love with this car. It was originally from Colorado. And then it was purchased by somebody, uh, a movie studio that is, up in Ontario. And... It was supposed to be in a movie along with another tornado that looked just like it, but it was not in very good shape. Uh, and if I remember correctly, the other tornado that was identical to this one was going to get destroyed in the movie. And they were going to use this one for all the pretty shots and things like that. And from what I was told by the former owner of this, who um, worked for the movie studio, is that uh, the movie canceled. And so they just dumped the cars at the auction. And I was there when the dumping happened, and I got it. I have loved this car for a long time. It's only got 77,000 original miles, and it is just in beautiful shape. It's got all original paint throughout. And I'm telling you, it's one of the most beautiful driving cars I've ever owned. I don't know if you can see it or not, but that's like a gold color at the dashboard. And that's without a doubt my favorite thing on this car. It's just so perfect and so beautiful. The only thing on the carpet that, in the car interior rather, that is not perfect is underneath the, that mat over there. That's from my detail guy who just polished and waxed it for me. There is some uh, fading on the carpet. Other than that, the interior is spotless. Absolutely no sun damage or any kind of damage uh, at all of any kind. It's just beautiful. I'm trying to move slowly here so you can really uh, see the condition of the interior. It's just unsurpassed. I think I say unsurpassed in every video I have, and I, uh, I don't know why I do that, but I guess it fits a lot of the cars I have. See the dashboard? Beautiful. Now, let me show you something if I can. One of my favorite things about driving this car is when you're sitting here in the driver's position, right above that position, if you can see the hood, see how the hood line comes straight back into the top of the dash? It's completely flat um, where the hood comes into the top of that dash. The only other cars I've ever seen in history that do that are the, um, the Eldorados of the same vintage. As I was saying a second ago, a lot of people will follow me on my website, which is supersportmotors.com. Let me say it again slower. Supersportmotors.com. They know that I uh, specialize in the 67 and 68 through 70 Eldorados because I love them. They're beautiful, and I know a lot about them. And I'm not sure if I've ever said this in the video before, but these particular Tornados that came out, uh, this body style that came out in 1971, and I think it went to 77 or 78, um, they were copied from the 67 and the 68 Eldorado. Everything about it was copied, uh, except for the sheet metal, of course, and the size of the engine is bigger uh, in this year than the first couple of years of the Eldorados in 67 and 68. And I used to know the story, but I forget. I believe they just simply copied Eldorado in the, uh, you know, the size of the car uh, with the uh, no B pillars, the back windows rolling down and such, because they were so beautiful and they were so smooth and gorgeous from 67 through 70. Everybody still wanted that. And that's what this is. Now, they're not worth as much as the um, 67 and 68 Eldorados. But they're pretty damn close. I can remember being a kid going up the road saying, Mommy, what's this? What's this? And if you don't know what that is, that's brake lights. It's one of the first cars that had that beautiful rear braking light system. And it's the coolest thing. They're beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now, I can't remember if I mentioned this or not, but this is an original paint car. There is no paintwork on this car. There is a few dings. Not dings, I'm sorry. Did not mean to say that. There's a few little spots on the paint where it has faded out because the former owner just spent his time 
buffing the car. You put the headlights on. Oh, let me show you something else here. On the other side of the car, this is very unique. By the way, everything in this car works. Shocking. The cruise control works. The air conditioning works perfectly. And there's something that you'll never see. You may see these clocks working, having been transformed over to a quartz movement. Uh, and in doing that, you'll notice that the second hand sweeps as opposed to clicks along. I'm going to be quiet. You can hear it. Yeah, it's the original movement time. 234. Well, yeah, 233. So she keeps good time. So again, cruise control works, air conditioning works, heat works, heat works. Everything works on this beast. Um, see the little vents down there? That means it's a air conditioned car, uh, as well as uh, over there. You don't you don't find that very often on these cars, uh, where the clock has the original movement like that. So again, my name is Michael Stanton. In case I haven't mentioned it already 10 times, my website is very simple. Supersportmotors.com My phone number is 315-853-1967 I repeat, 315-853-1967 I'm right in Clinton, New York. I am a classic car dealer. I do it strictly and absolutely and only for fun. And hence, that is the reason I take trades from people when they have a car uh, to offer me that I'm interested in. Because I love it. It gives me the opportunity to drive a car or a motorcycle that I wouldn't normally have. So, you're welcome to call me and um, tell me what you have for a trade. All right. Clinton, New York. Zip code 13323. I'm right in the middle of New York State, right off the New York State Thruway, exit 32. Clinton, New York is a beautiful little historic town. And a lot of people who buy cars from me will commonly stay overnight here because it's just such a cute and beautiful little place to visit and to relax. And I've lived here 20 years. Retired from the Air Force as a major back in October of 2001. And uh, I've lived here happily ever since. I'm going to recap very quickly for you a 1973 Oldsmobile Tornado front wheel drive in case you don't know that 77,000 original miles it is completely and absolutely an original a paint car um, as well as the interior nothing has been altered while I have my keys in my hand I'll show you the trunk during my tenure with the car I put a couple of thousand miles on it and all I have ever ran in this car is uh, 91 octane non-ethanol gas. That is the original spare, if you can't tell. And again, those little white mats are simply in here because I just had it polished and waxed. And it came out beautiful. Undercarriage is very, very, very nice. I'm not going to crawl underneath right now. I'm sure somebody's going to ask me this, and the answer is yes. If you take a look closely at this car, you'll notice that the top color is gray. It's a kind of a slate blue-gray, and then you've got the sky blue uh, paint, kind of a sky blue paint, and then a slate blue uh, vinyl top. And it is the coolest color combination. For years, I thought it was just wrong, but it's not. It's just the way that it is. And it's a beautiful color combination because the interior color is an exact match for the exterior. So the only splash of color, if you will, is that grayish color top on top, and it's really, really nice. All right, so please visit my website, supersportmotors.com. I'll have another 100 photos of this on there, filmed in the, in the autumn of 2019. And if you're interested in buying this car, please call me, and I will talk with you at length about it. Do not text me. I will not text you back. If you choose to text me, do at your own peril. I'm just not going to get back to you because I'm tired of texting and it doesn't work. And I've also learned something very, very important through the years when it comes to selling cars. If somebody only has the energy to text you about a car you have for sale, they're not serious. But if they'll go through the trouble of picking up the phone and call you and talk to you, 
then you've got uh, somebody who is being genuine. Okay, I love this car, it's a beautiful car. I think it'll make somebody very happy. Matter of fact, I know it will. Good luck finding one in this kind of condition with that many miles on it, with original paint and that extremely beautiful color combination. They're not easy to come by. You can actually come by a 67 or a 68 Eldorado in similar condition with less effort. And trust me, if anybody knows, I do. Thank you very much. I love doing these videos. Subscribe to me if you really want to. I don't do anything with people who subscribe to my YouTube videos other than, uh, you know, it's good for my ego, I guess, to know that I got a couple thousand people watching me. <laughs> but what's cool about the fact that uh, if you subscribe to me on YouTube is that uh, every time I list a car for sale, I put it on YouTube first before I put it on my website. Okay, so again, my website is supersportmotors.com. Thank you very much for looking at this beautiful 73 Eldorado. This is one of those cars I own that's going to make me shed a tear when it leaves my garage. Thank you very much.